Hey guys, I want to share with you a little cooking tip. We're doing cooking segments today and we're at the Rose Canyon Cantina and Grill and standing next to me is Chef Joe. And Chef Joe just did a dish for us and he's going to redo the part where he puts the batter on. Or actually, he's going to cook the calamari for us. So you're going to see the finished dish on this in an upcoming episode. But this is a great little cooking tip that I want to share with you that Chef Joe just showed me and taught me. And it's a cool way, so if you have lots of pieces, I guess you can do this with fish too, but if you got yes. tons of pieces like with calamari, this is a quick technique that you can batter it and do it real simple. You can use my fish batter if or you shrimp. want. Shrimp, you can do shrimp, shrimp too? Yes. All right, so Chef, can you show our people how to do that? So yes, uh, what you want to do, you have a buttermilk with eggs. Buttermilk with eggs. And then just... And that's calamari in there. Uh, yes, mix it uh, very well. So what you want to do, you have to scoop this, so to make sure there's a, a, a corn, uh, the breading All in there. here. So he's going to take the calamari and just put it right into the basket. In the basket. And it's all been coated already with the buttermilk and the egg. And, and I thought when the first time I saw you do this. I thought at this point we would just have one massive ball oh, no. all stuck together. So that's why I want to share this with our viewers. So what you want to do, you're going to go, you're going to coat it and then shake it. Add more batter. And then, like I think ten times, oh, five, six times mm -hmm. until it separate. See? So there you go. And that's the technique. That's just a, a simple technique that uh, Chef Joe just taught me today. And you can see how every little piece is all by itself. It's not stuck together. It's just one individual piece of calamari or piece of squid. And this is something you can do. If you're out fishing and you got some live squid left over at the end of the day, cut it up and use it like this. And in the actual dish that you're gonna see on TV, uh, Chef Joe made us uh, tacos out of calamari, which I've yes. never had before. So it's pretty cool. So he's going to go over there and drop it in the fryer so you can see that because it's a real quick process. Yes. So just cook it for 45 seconds until, gold, until it becomes golden brown and it's done. And there we go. That's so simple. It's very simple. And you could uh, spice it with Mexican spice, any kind of rub you can get in a local uh, grocery store. Mm -hmm. Just add a little bite to it. Yes. It's really simple. It's really delicious. Again, it's just calamari. Really good. Burning hot. Just get them out of the fryer. And um, Chef Joe, I think you would tell the viewers too that just like fish with calamari, you do not want to overcook it. You don't want to overcook it. If you overcook it, it's going to be Really tough. gummy. Yes. And you're not going to like it. Yes. And the reason that these dishes come out so good, the ingredients are fresh, and the chefs like Chef Joe know, do not overcook it. It's already dead. You're just going to put it in there for, like you said, 45 seconds. When it gets this nice crispy brown, it's done. Yes. All right, well, thank you, Chef Joe. That was a great tip. Just want to share with it, all of you, our viewers, and buying you for more cooking tips, more fishing tips, subscribe right here on our YouTube channel and you'll get these. They post them every Thursday. And uh, make sure you subscribe to me on Twitter, Instagram, Facebook, where we're always putting up little tips like this. And Chef Joe, that's a great little tip. Thanks again. You're welcome. All right, we'll talk to you all real soon. Okay.